पाँच मई 2016 को ये बीमार हो गई थी इसके हमने टेस्ट कराए थे जब हमें लाल पैथले वालों ने कहा कि इसे किसी अच्छे हॉस्पिटल में लेके जाइए तो हम इसे मैदानता हॉस्पिटल में लेके गए भूमिका वॉज सफरिंग फ्रॉम अ वेरी रेयर डिजीज प्राइमरी हाइपर ऑक्सलूरिया देर इज एन एंजाइम इन द लिवर इट्स कॉल्ड ए टी जी दैट इज एबसेंट बिकॉज यू नो बाई बर्थ यू डो नॉट है राइट जीन टू प्रोड्यूस इट now she was uh, around 4 months old when she was there and we diagnosed her to have primary hyperoxaluria at 4 months of her life because her brother already died of a kidney failure now since last 11 years uh, we've been seeing her and see she slowly progressed to uh, renal failure so actually the problem is in the liver there is an enzyme in the liver which cleaves the oxalate so oxalate gets deposited in various organs bones kidneys so kidneys are actually secondary to the liver so if we don't correct the liver enzyme if we just do a kidney transplant this will recur so this child needed a combined liver and kidney transplant liver transplant alone is a very complicated operation it takes about 8 to 10 hours involves a uh, removal of a diseased liver and putting in a new liver with, with complicated connections including use of microscopes and stuff pediatric liver transplantation is even more complex and that's because um children have um unique diseases because of which they have liver failure or kidney failure and in children when you do organ transplantation their blood vessels are very minute now add to it a kidney transplant so this operation becomes even more complex and in bhumika's case before all this could happen we also had to divide the donor liver into two so that two recipients uh could have liver transplants so the whole thing took us about 30 hours involved like about 45 of us doctors and uh, specialized ot technicians and and people after the operation it's pretty complicated management so they are on the ventilator they need uh, special fluid management and then when they come off the ventilator they need um, careful meticulous management for both the liver and kidney to not have any any kind of trauma and work uh, to their uh, potential to be able to do a liver and kidney combined transplant in a child is obviously a very complex operation which is not undertaken in very many centers across the world bhumika who's had a combined liver and kidney transplant exemplifies that strength <laughs>